Hey, everybody out there. I am in the car. Now, you want me to write this down? Handling some business. I have Barbara. Oh, hold on, let me get a pen. In the car with me. And I'm about to just do a little Jolly Rancher lollipop video, guys. Since I gotta wait, so why not make a video, right? Put in there, sir. Let me get right. Pen. Okay. You got one? Mm -mm. Give me a pen. Thank you. Girl? Huh? Okay, I'm back, y'all. Okay, what's the number, sir? <laughs> Hello? Mm -hmm. 101. Somebody gave me these Jolly Rancher mm -hmm. lollipops, guys, and I got a, a lemon one, which I never had lemon Jolly Rancher. Seven, three, this this one is watermelon. I got an apple one, and I think cherry. Hello? And my yeah. God, these this are so the good, phone? guys. It's so good. Yes, mm. I'm mm. here. Anyway, oh, okay. Let me see. I'm sitting outside. Just of a second. My client Michael. Okay, can you hear me now? Apartment. Can you hear me? And um Okay. Yeah. I'm not like I haven't went through the orientation yet, guys, to become mm -hmm. his PC worker, but I will be this Thursday. It was supposed okay. to be last All Thursday, right. but it was so far away. You know, I couldn't All get right, there driving. I didn't know where it was, so I'm gonna go this Thursday coming up. But anyway, he's my client, guys, and he's really sweet, really nice. So I'm waiting outside of, of his apartment because what I do is like I have been buying him little things, this, that, and the other, and we would make like a little uh, dowry, you know, and I would keep tabs on what I spent. And when he get his check, he pays me back. So today is the first. So I'm here to collect my money. <laughs> yeah. mm hmm. Mm -hmm. And I'm on the south side of town, which is where I get those big bomb, the Jolly Rancher big bomb pops. Only thing is, and I want some so bad, but guys, I just think that if I go get them, by the time I get home, they you know, I'll be melted and I'll be mad. Take a little lick, guys, or a big lick. Take a big lick, because it's good. Anyway, it's busy out here. Y'all know how it is on the first. Everybody out, driving, walking, crawling, climbing. <laughs> they doing it. Wow. Here, over here, y'all. Barbara, especially me. on the south side. I hate the south side. The south side rough to me. And really, it just, I don't like it because you guys, I had a girlfriend who was actually murdered here on the south side. Me and her was together the night before she was killed. She had went into the store because we didn't have any money. I, that's when I was out there, y'all. I ain't had no money. She ain't had no money. And she went into a store and stole two Wildwood sodas. Y'all know them, but they was 35 cent then. But she stole two of those, some hot peanuts, you know, the two for a dollar peanuts. <laughs> two of those and some Vienna sausages. I'll never forget. But yes. what happened was she was a stud, guys. She was gay. She was a stud. But she would turn tricks, you know, and make them think that she was feminine and all that stuff until she got them where she wanted them, then she'd rob them. So that didn't work, you know, that night. What happened was we had spent, like, and believe it or not, guys, we, we was in a... We weren't even in the house, guys. We was in a gangway. So, it wasn't good, y'all, for me. I was homeless, and I mean, I had relatives and stuff, but I, you know, I was out there, y'all, out there. So, me and her was actually in a fucking gangway, you know, in between the store, a store and I guess a, a building. And yeah, we sat right there, ate our little Vienna sausages and peanuts and soda, and we went on our separate ways the next day. No, 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 I'm, I'm wrong, I'm wrong. After we finished doing that, she went on her way and I went on my separate way the same night. Come to find out, 
I wound up going to a house where I was partying. And right next to this house, guys, was a hotel. And the hotel is where she was. And this, it was called National Avenue, which is not far from where I am right now. But yeah, she was in the hotel. She had caught her a trick, had them in there, whatever, whatever. Becoming a new customer. And um, it was just so ironic, guys, because I was in the house directly next door to this hotel. I was in the house, she was in the hotel, but that's where she met her fate. She, it was the wrong person. Um, and yeah, he, he strangled her to death. And it was, it was sick. You know, the next day, because I was in there partying all night. So the next day when I come out, I saw all the yellow tape and stuff around that hotel. And, you know, I'm like, dang, you know, what happened? Because people all around, like, what happened? What happened? And they was like, oh, girl got killed. I'm like, who is old girl? They was like, you know, your friend, you know her, you know her, you know her. And I'm like, oh, who? Because I didn't know she was going to be right next door to me. We had went on our own separate ways. So, yeah, y'all. It wasn't good, you know. But what happened was... Use this one. Here go, I light it right here. Anyway, y'all. Yeah, that's what happened. You know, I, I didn't know it was her. And for days... I, people was just talking about it, talking about it, talking about it. I'm like, they was like, you know her, you was with her. I'm like, who? You know, I was with a lot of people here, Barbara. Like, you like it? Got it? Mm hmm All right. Anyway, y'all, a couple days later, I had went to her job because I was dating the guy that owned, it was like a refrigeration type of company. And she had introduced me to him quite some time ago. Hey, Michael! Yeah, I'm gonna have to take a little break real quick. Gotta get this money real quick and I'll be right back to finish this video. Okay, guys. It's a little loud, so excuse all the outside sounds and everything. But anyway, like I was saying, guys, the very next day I got up and it was yellow tape all around that hotel. I didn't know who it was. People kept saying I did, but I really, I was, my mind was in the clouds, so, you know, still. So, I didn't find out until who it, I didn't find out who it was mm -hmm. until a couple days after, like I said, when I went to go see her boss where she used to work. Sometimes she worked there. But then he's the one that told me that it was her. And I was so overwhelmed because me and her was tight. We had been through a lot of stuff together, guys. And it was just really sad. So, I just kind of hated the South Side after that. I just really kind of hated the South Side after that happened. That really, really hurt me. You know, so. You hoes, lay it down, lay it down, lay it down. The thing is Sunday next weekend. The Locust Street thing. What? The Locust Street thing is next Sunday. You gonna have some money? I should. I'm gonna have to at least have 30 or 40 bucks. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, y'all, say hi to Barbara. Wait. Damn, girl. Hold on. I didn't put slim. Say hi to your people. Bob. Hi. <laughs> Hello. How are you? Now that's a better picture of me. I look kind of chubby, but. Oh, shit. Sure. Yeah. Everybody chubby. That's all right. Anyway, guys, let me go on the pool to the back. I just want to, since I have to do some waiting, y'all. See this stuff here? I got me some eyeliner. It's liquid? Yeah. Let me have I one. Got... You got two? I let got me two. have it. Yeah, because I ain't heard. Mine is running out. I just gave me some liquid liner, y'all. I sure wear it, see? My sister got me to wearing this. Yeah, it's Bethany. nice. Yeah, girl, because it stay on. It don't even come off. And I got Just you wipe it off. too, but I got to get some glue. I had some glue, but somebody stole them. 
I know who stole that damn Jessica did. I All I gotta do is get some bonding glue. Yeah. That's like 59 cents. For the eyelashes. For the eyelashes. Really? Yeah, yeah, that's okay. it. You know the glue? Well, yeah. Yeah, yeah. and then because she, uh, I had them up in my room one day and they took my perfume. I had three bottles. Mm. They took two bottles. <laughs> Anyway, y'all, let me let me pull my butt around this corner because I got to pull around the back. Michael, he he came out in his wheelchair this time, so mm. I'm gonna pull around the back and see what he wants, guys. But anyway, thank you all for tuning into this little car lollipop video. <laughs> okay, everybody, stay tuned for the next one.